Hello everybody and welcome back to Mario Party. What could be the finale series, finale map, I haven't decided yet as of this recording. See, here's the thing. There are two maps that I still need to unlock. Uh, I believe one of them is the magma map. And then I'm sure the, f the final one is like, it's either a Bowser one or a rainbow one or some special thing. And I don't have either of them yet. I would need to play a whole other round to unlock the magma one. I believe it's called magma something, or has magma in the name. I could be wrong. I could be making that up. I only looked once. So I'd have to play one round to do that, which is fine. That's not a big deal. But... In order to unlock the special final bonus map, you have to collect 100 stars. Now, I don't know if you've paid much attention to this series. Chances are you haven't, because first and foremost, nobody watches my videos. At least at this point. Maybe retroactively they'll get popular or something, but at this point there were like a few. A few people have watched these videos. And the retention rate, very low. So thank you for that. I could be literally talking to nobody at this point. Just like at the end of the Devil May Cry. Regardless. I would have to unlock, uh, I'd have to get 100 stars. I've got like 9. Because I don't win all the time. This game's actually kind of difficult. So that leaves me with a couple of options. I could either... Well, a few options, I guess. One, I could just end the series. Either after the Magma one, or... After this one. This one is going to go to 20 episodes. 20 episodes is a good ending point. I feel like 20 days is enough Mario Party for anybody. Uh, especially me. I'm a little done with it. The variety of the minigames is no longer there. It just kind of feels not fun anymore. Video games is supposed to be fun, y'all. So I could end the series. But I'm a completionist. Not to the point that I need to, like, 100% everything. Don't get me wrong, I'm not that person. But I feel like if there's an easily accessible way to complete something, you should do it. And this feels like it would be that. So chances are I'm not going to end the series here. I might. And if this winds up being the last three episodes, so be it. You will just have to deal with that, I guess. What are you going to do? Get mad? Like, there's going to be two of you, maybe. Who care? But I do want that completion. I want to say, hey, we did at least... We did one of each map. That's enough, right? So I could try to legitimately unlock that. Which would take me several, several, several hours. Make me hate this game, probably. And then by the time I actually unlock it, I would probably spend the entire episode, episodes, ranting about how much this game sucks. So, I'm thinking that's not the case. As I try to suppress a yawn. I'm tired. It's been a long day. And I'm sick. I actually like this minigame. We hadn't played it before. This map. But it's a fun one. It's basically just go to the thing. But you can block people off and stuff. It's, it's a good. It's a good one. Where was I? So I could do it legitimately. But 
chances are not high that I would do that. Maybe the magma one. I might unlock that legitimately because I think even to cheat, I'd need to play one round and then just kind of hack in the coin thing. I don't think you can just hack it that it's unlocked. I think you need to say, hey, I got this many stars, this many coins. So I'll probably need to play one anyway. And yeah, that basically foreshadowed my other option, which is to cheat. Which is to use... Uh, I can't remember what the, the the thing is. I don't think it's a game shark at this point. I think it was like a game genie, maybe? Perhaps? And do that. To unlock the final two maps. And... And then people won't whine at me. And I won't feel like I've let anyone down. All single single person who is watching the video at this point. Shout out to you. This is like episode 17, I think. Which is pretty far along in a series that doesn't really change. Like, you're not watching this for the story... You're probably not watching for the gameplay at this point, because it's it's all the same. It's it's you're watching if you're watching, you're either watching to get to the end. Like me playing. I'm just playing to get to the end. Or you're watching for the commentary, in which case, thank you. Uh, the commentary's not been good. Commentary is never good, because I am doing the commentary, and therefore it is bad. But thank you anyway. So we'll see. Uh, you'll find out. You'll know. Well, you won't know as of watching this, I suppose. I'll know as of you watching this. So just know that I know. Not as of recording. Because I, this is literally the last Mario Party I've recorded. I have moved on to bigger and better things. But who, who, nobody said that you can't record series simultaneously. So I am doing that. I haven't started the commentary for Super Monkey Ball yet. But I will do that at some point. Or I'll trash it. I think I've recorded like nine episodes of it though, so... Chances are I'm not going to trash it. It's not like Chocobo Racing, which was literally less than an hour and a half of footage. And I will re be replaying that game at some point. Because I like it. I don't think it's as good as Mario Kart, don't get me wrong. But I like Chocobos. And I like Final Fantasy. And I kind of like the hipster aspect of it. I like being able to say, hey, I totally played this game that you don't know about. That is the same game as the popular game. But not the popular game because that makes me smile. I found out the other day, I was looking at the games that I own slash have access to, and I was looking over just series that I have and series uh, where I have installments missing. Like, I don't own all of the, for instance, all of the Bomberman games. I have... Never played a Bomberman game, by the way. I've watched a friend play one on his, I believe, Game Boy Advance one time. While we were, like, in the car being driven somewhere as children. That's all I remember. So, I may eventually play a Bomberman game. We'll see. Anyway, so I was looking over a series that I own, and I came across the Digimon series. And I own a few Digimon games. I haven't played them all, but I own them. So, like, I own Digimon Rumble Arena 1 and 2 and a couple of the Digimon World games and the two Cyber Story games. Digimon Story, Cyber Sleuth, and Digimon Story. Hacker's Memory, I think, is the other one. Both for PlayStation 4. They are very fun games, by the way. I love those games. 
I probably put 70-ish hours in each of them. Because they're just Final Fantasy, but with Digimon. And I think that's pretty cool. So I was looking at uh, other Digimon games that happen to exist. Just to see, like, what else is out there. Because I knew there were a bunch of mobile games that I had never touched. And I came across Digimon Racing. They made a Digimon Mario Kart. From what I can tell from screenshots. Because I was too lazy slash stupid to look up gameplay. I gotta get this game. It's for, I believe, Game Boy Advance. Don't quote me on that, but... Because I'm not looking it up while I'm watching this. I'm watching the video just like you guys. I will maybe eventually commentate on a video in this Mario Party series. I haven't done that in a while. Not really. I did a little bit for The Last World, but like only on the last episode, which was the last five turns. I'm getting into more of a groove. Oh, this is actually the... You see I died there. That was experimental death. So I wanted them to not win so that uh, they would have not have enough coins to get the toad because I was closest but I also rolled last so they each had a chance to get to toad before I did and if you get to toad on this map he switches with Bowser so every second person who gets there barring a question mark block uh, gets a star essentially if you have enough coins so prior to this mini game they did not have enough coins so I'm like hey can I grief them uh, it turns out it's very difficult to grief them and if you die miraculously because it's actually, if you're playing legitimately, very difficult to die. You don't get coins at all. So that was a dumb, dumb play by me. There you go. You got some Mario Party commentary. I just explained my strategy for playing this video game. Uh-oh. He picked me. And he picked himself. Oh no, I have to give him 10 coins anyway. So it didn't matter. Well, maybe it mattered. Because I still get to the start before him if he rolled on the chance. But now I don't even have enough for the star, so it doesn't matter. I was right originally. This game's dumb. This game's not good. So Digimon Racing. Uh, I don't know how well a Game Boy Advance game is going to record and work as a streaming... Or, not a streaming thing. Goodness, no. At some point I want to try streaming. I'll commentate about that someday. But I do want to try streaming. I have to get a new setup first. Like, I want to get that new mic. Uh, my webcam is on my monitor. It is. Let me see. A bright cam 2.0 megapixels. This monitor is like five years ish old. I assume most webcams now are better than 2.0 megapixels. Also, bright cam, I assume, means that you don't need a terrible amount of light. Not that I'm very photogenic anyway. I haven't done a face reveal to the internet in a long, long time. In fact, the only public picture of me may not even be there anymore, but if you want to search it up, when I was a member of The Escapist prior to being hired by The Escapist to write movie reviews, they did a community spotlight on me. I think it was Nazrin. Uh, was the, the the community manager at the time, I believe. And she did that. And I posted a picture of myself. It was just a selfie uh, taken from a webcam. I think, actually, it might have been this webcam. Uh, and that may or may not still be on there. So if you want to check that out, you can check that out. I was going somewhere with that. Oh, yeah, streaming. I'll do it someday. Maybe. I don't know. I feel like it could it could go fine. Look how good I'm getting at this minigame, though. 
97. It's just, that's just great. It's a good place to end, too. So, I will see you guys next time.